grandfather, Albert Trail, was a World War II veteran. For those like Jared Riddle, honoring loved ones on Memorial Day is not a day of sorrow, but a cherished tradition. It does give us a chance to actually take a minute to gather as a family. There was like 20 of us out here to stop and share old stories and make sure that they're not forgotten. And Riddle says his grandfather is one of his biggest inspirations, and remembering his acts of bravery as a Marine during World War II is a source of pride in his own life. I can't even put it into words what it means to me. I was always trying to get him to tell stories. He told me a little bit about the landing in the Pacific. I know he drove a tank, an amphibious tank. Though every Memorial Day is special for Riddle, this year is an important milestone. He passed away almost 20 years ago now, and it does not feel like that. He was a very good man, he served his country, very proud of that, very proud of all these soldiers. George Trail is also here honoring Albert, his dad. And my dad was John Wayne before there ever was a John Wayne. He was only one of a kind, you'll never duplicate him, you'll never ever see anyone quite like him. For George, today serves as an opportunity to remember everything about his dad, not just his service, but the lessons and legacy he left. Be honest. Don't hurt anybody, don't take advantage of anybody, and try to always do the right thing. If you do the right thing, then good things will happen back to you. Though there are many challenges and grief that come with losing a hero, both say they are thankful not just for Albert's service, but for all of those who served. They basically sacrificed their lives and their livelihood to make sure the rest of us had a good livelihood. The Trail family tells me they will continue to honor their loved ones who served as well as all of the veterans here for years to come. Reporting in Mesa today, I'm Sarah Robinson for Arizona's Family.